Hi students, coming to the next topic in the subject software engineering was software prototyping. So what is this software prototyping? Now let us see that. A software prototyping is a rapid development of a system. We call it as a, a software prototype is rapid development. Rapid development of a system so whenever there is a rapid development of a system you said that is a software prototype is using so why we require the prototype is it necessary to discuss about the prototype in the project uh, to develop the project why the prototyping is required so let me explain that first thing why we need a prototype to reduce cost to reduce cost and to improve the quality of a final project we need the prototype quality of a final product we need prototyping and next second one it is this prototyping is useful for useful for risk assessment it is going to be assess the risk what is the risk that is present in the product developing the product useful for risk assessment and as a means of as a means of means for validation to end users and the next why we are using still why we are using prototype so one thing is to reduce the cost and improve the quality of final product we are using the prototyping and this prototyping is useful for risk assessment and as a means for validation to the end users it is doing the validations to end users and it is useful for risk assessment still the principal use whatever the principle that is used in the prototyping the principal use is to help customers as well as developers prototyping is used to help the customers and developers understand the understand the requirements of system so to clear understand the requirement of system requirements for system so to clear understands for the requirements for the systems uh, this prototyping will be uh, the prototyping concept will be very useful for the customers as well as the develop so there are different phases that are present in the prototyping what are those phases now let us see the phases of prototyping So, what are the different phases that are pre uh, present in the prototyping? So, the first phase is prototyping planning. Prototyping plan. So, what we are doing here? In the prototype, this prototyping uh, planning is used to gain further specifications. further specification requirements from customer so if you do the prototype planning you can gain the further specification requirements from the customer and convey ideas to the customer there is a chance to convey ideas to customers and you can know uh, knowing the more risky aspects of project if there is any risky aspect you can find out the risky aspects of project so with the help of this prototyping plan you can gain the further specification requirements from customers and you can convey the ideas to the customers and if there is any risky aspects in the project you can be identified so that is the first phase in the first phase you can uh, identify all these things and in the second phase that is the outline definition second phase is outline definition so in the outline definition this stage 
focuses in determine the level of functionality determine the level of functionality of prototype and documenting the decisions so this stage focus in determining the level of functionality of prototyping and documenting these decisions so this is the second phase now coming to the third phase so what is the third phase the third phase is executable prototyping executable prototyping so what we are doing in this phase so this phase, this stage is is the development of prototype. So in the executable prototyping, we are uh, developing the prototype. So development of prototype to construct to construct prototype. Development of prototype and to construct the prototype quickly. So, uh, actually, in the executable prototyping, uh, the main use of uh, this phase is to develop the prototype. So, if you want to need to construct a prototype very quickly, you need to construct a prototype quickly. We use visual basic prototype tool. So the first thing is we have to execute uh, the prototype. The development of prototype has to be done fastly. So if you need to done it fastly, you have to use some tools. That is a visual. One of the tool is visual basic prototype tool. With the help of this tool, you can easily construct the quickly construct the prototype. So in this is a, a third phase that is an executable prototyping. So next fourth stage, fourth phase, evaluation report so after the executable you can go for the evaluation so at this point at this point feedback will be feedback will be gathered from both management and customers management and customers so in the evaluation report we have to take the feedback if the feedback will be help uh, it's just gather the information from both the management and customers thus allowing the prototype to be evaluated so uh, we can evaluate the prototype by taking the feedbacks from management and the customers so after the evaluation there, there may be a chances like the customer may happy means the okay we are following these uh, prototypes and these are the schedules we are taking we will get the output like this if you get the correct output then the customer may happy and there, there may be a chance the project will be deemed unfeasible and will not continue also after the evaluation of the report and there may be a chance the customer list more requirements after the evaluation of the report so these are all the different conditions that may arise after the evaluation of the report so this everything these phases of prototyping can be uh, represented in the diagrammatic form so that you will if you see the diagram then you will understand what exactly this complete phases of prototyping establish prototype objective Establish prototype objective. Define prototype functionality. Next, develop develop prototype. So here I am representing the different phases of the prototype evaluate prototype so whatever i explained in the phases of prototype i am representing in the form of pictorial representation and here prototyping plan
आउटलाइन डेफिनेशन एग्जीक्यूशन एग्जीक्यूटेबल और यू कैन टेक एग्जीक्यूटेबल प्रोटोटाइप एवेल्युएशन रिपोर्ट सो दिस आर ऑल द डिफरेंट फेजेस ऑफ द प्रोटोटाइप दिस प्रोटोटाइप प्लान फर्स्ट फेज ओके दिस इज द फेज वन and the phase 2 is outline definition phase 3 is the executable prototype and for phase 4 is the evaluation report for uh, prototyping so here prototyping planning will establish the first it establishes the prototype objective next it establishes the defined prototyping functionality after that it develops the prototype finally it evaluate the prototype so after completion of first stage first phase the established prototype defined next it is going to define the prototype functionality so next it is develop the prototype finally it evaluate the prototype so these are all the phases of phases of prototyping thank you